Hi, this is Mike Regan with Transax 2 Minute Warning for the week of October 3rd. In this week's 2 Minute Warning, we've got some news about FedEx, some issues that are affecting negotiation at the West Coast ports, and an example of how one company lives out its commitment to being a shipper of choice. Recently, FedEx has made some news. In their most recent call with the financial analysts, they said that they are seeing signs of a global recession. Now that got people's attention, but what really got attention was when they announced an increase for FedEx ground services of 6.9%, the largest in FedEx's history. Now we expect UPS to follow suit here shortly with similar increases since these companies often move very closely together. Now when we see this happen, we often get questions from shippers about how these proposed changes will affect our budgets in the upcoming year. So if you're wondering how these proposed changes from FedEx or UPS could affect your parcel budgets in 2023, you need to give me a call or send me an email and ask about our parcel reporting toolbox. I'll have one of my associates get right back to you and help you understand why this is an easy to use great tool that will be able to help you quantify the potential impact that these changes could have on your freight budget. Now there's something else that we need to share with you and that are some issues that are affecting West Coast port negotiations. Last week I spoke at the Journal of Commerce's Inland Distribution Program. It was fantastic, but one of the reasons I really enjoyed it was I had the opportunity to talk to the experts at the JLC about what's really happening. Now we mentioned in a previous two minute warning that when I talked with the number two person at the Port of LA, Noel Hasabaga, he said that there wouldn't be a strike, but they were paying attention to what was going on at a local level. Extremely, extremely important stuff and we'll keep you posted because it affects the Port of Seattle and it affected the Port of Oakland and when we saw the security guards at LA and the Port of Long Beach say that they were going to authorize a strike vote it's something that you need to pay attention to you can count on us here at Transact to do that just for you finally I want to close out this two-minute warning by giving a shout out to my friends at Samar great company out of Seattle and they're in the apparel sector a huge company and one of the things that they do and do a great job of is living out their commitment to being a shipper of choice a little thing that may not seem a big deal to you but during driver appreciation week September 11th to the 17th they passed out these dynamite little caps said thank you to the drivers let them know they respected the job that they do and appreciated their work now if you're interested in learning more about how you can become a shipper of choice and the economic benefits and how I can help you lower your cost, send me an email or give us a call. I can also share information, like I said, about the parcel reporting toolbox. We do all of this because with each and every two minute warning, we're here to remind you we're on your team. We're here to help and we're passionate about seeing you be successful. Thanks for your time.